Hey everyone, I'm Natasha from Rocksmith Discover and I'm here at NAM, and I'm going to show you how to survive your NAM experience. My first thing about coming to NAM is food. My first day here, I pretty much didn't eat at all because I didn't plan well. So when you see things like the food opening up, you want to be first in line because the lines kind of pile up pretty quickly. So know where the food is, make sure you take breaks and eat. NAM is huge. There's multiple floors, multiple sections. So I'd highly recommend looking at the map. When you look at the map, you're going to see there's lots of different sections of where your different interests might be, whether that's guitar, drums, DJing, DAWs, all those different things are divided in different areas, so it really helps to plan out your day and where you want to walk, otherwise you're going to be doing a lot of back and forth. The other thing too with looking at the app is also seeing what kind of talks and performances are happening and trying to chart out where those will be so that you can make them on time. drum section of NAM, and if you can tell I'm kind of yelling because it's really loud so I would highly recommend bringing earplugs if you're gonna be in here all day there's also a couple different booths that you can go to to get custom made earplugs made for you so that might be an option when you show up One of the coolest things I think at NAM is the fact that you can find all different types of instruments too. So we're in the brass, woodwinds, strings, and percussion section. And even though I don't play those kinds of instruments, I think it's nice to check it out and you can actually test some things out. So I mean, if you have any interest in the future, this is a good place to try things out. So we're probably in like my favorite section of NAM so far. We're kind of in the electronic music area where there's Pioneer, Allen and & Heath, and a lot of cool things to check out, especially for DJing. But there's also like lighting and club stuff, so we're gonna go check it out right now. So that's my guide to survival at NAM. The last thing I would say is make sure you have business cards because this is a great place to meet people, especially people that you've probably seen on the internet a lot that you'd like to meet in person. And for me, having water and a little bag so I can collect other people's swag, it's a great way to stay connected. So thank you, signing out from NAM. peace.